Pokemon! And welcome back to another Pokemon episode. And today, we're doing another one of the Costco tins. Today, we're doing the Vaporeon tin. Let's see if we can get something good in this one as well. Uh, last one we did was the Flareon tin. And we did get some good cards in that. Uh, we got the Butterfly V. Um, or about a free V, sorry, and we've got that cool Steelix card. And the ah, let's get this open. That's I think it's a secret rare after I found out. Uh, but yeah, it was, it was a cool looking card. So let's see if we can get some more cool looking cards in this tin. Um, but yeah, these are the ones you can get in Costco. Uh, my girlfriend's got memberships, so she managed to get me a few of them. She got me the Flareon, which we saw last time, the Porion, Jolteon, and then the big one. So we're going to work our way through each of them and see what we do get. This one is. You see, you get a Vaporeon tin in it, and you get a Pokeball tin. Uh, last one we got was the Great Ball, which I actually have up here. There's the Great Ball. Uh, this one we got a regular Pokeball, and the little Vaporeon tin. Uh, again, this one is different to the ones you can normally get in the shops, which is this one, which is one my girlfriend got previously. Uh, but yeah. So yeah, you see they're both different, different sets. But let's see what we get. Let's get this open and... Remember last time, this was a difficult one to get out, yeah, because that's stuck on the back. But the big tin isn't stuck on the back, that's sort of like just put in there. But it's still got to be a bit fiddly and tricky to get it out. If I can get it out. Without breaking everything, there we go, out. There we go, there's the box. box is the same as the last box, really. Uh, but these are what we're looking for. We're looking at these two tins here. We get a Pokeball and a Vaporeon. Again, we'll start with the Pokeball and see what we get in this one. So that's what we got the good cards in last time. So let's see if I struggle again opening this because I really struggled last time trying to open these Pokeball ones. And it's going to happen again, isn't it? Yay! Okay, it's going to be worse, isn't it? Um, oh my god. Why is it just these ones I struggle opening? Um, it's no good with the balls, am I? Oh my god. Come on, Pokeball, just open. Ow. There we go, okay, ball's open. Let's get this pack open and see what's in this. Ooh, that's a cool cover. Uh, got a coin. This one here is the dog again. I Yeah, I think we got that last time. Dog one. Let's pop you there. And the packs we get is a Cosmic Eclipse, Upside Down Vivid Voltage, and a Rebel Clash. Um, Cosmic Eclipse, I think that's... Is that the one we got the Steelix in? Uh, I can't remember if it is or not, but this is the one we're going to open first because I think the cover's cool. All the little baby ones, Togepi, Cleffa, um, Ig Igglytuff, Igglybuff, or something like that. Um, I, I can't remember what that one is. <laughs> uh, let's get open, and there is the code for people. So one, two, three, four, to the front. Let's see, yeah, yeah, these are the ones. You've got a Psychic Energy, a, what's it? Velibur and Bryce Man. Okay. Oh, we've got a cool Jolteon. That's a cool looking card. Uh, Ends Resolve, Dealing, Tidiursa, Golit, Dupida, Helipar thing. Oh, there's our reverse holo. It's a Glalie. So we didn't get a one of those cool little alt art ones. And a rare one was a Trevant. Okay, well, that's okay. Good. It's a, not a great start. Not as good as the last one when we've got that cool Steelix card. We'll do a Vivage Voltage next because. Previous voltage ones can sometimes be pretty good. Let's get this one here open and see what we get in this pack. Let's see, and the code is there. One, two, three, four. And let's get into the pack. So we've got a darkness energy to start with for this vivid voltage one. Uh, another bird. A hit on top. We've got a cool little one there. Macargo. Whooper. Got a whooper. A uh, little bug thing underground, crying bunny thing. Jewel. Oh, that's a cool little. That's a Play-Doh. A cool little Play-Doh Jewelba. That's a cool card. A uh, Wellmere, C dot reverse hollow, and the rare one is a Metagross. We put you guys there. And next, let's go. Sword and Shield Rebel Clash. What can we get in the Rebel Clash one? Are we going to get something good? Only time will tell. Open. So there is the code for the game. One, two, three, four. Put you guys there. And let's go. Let's go. We got a grass energy, a chatot, a lampant, lampent, um, is there a gla, mine, claiming far fetched, squirrel, Mr. Mime, 
a Blaring Mr. Mime Caterpie, uh, Barboach, uh, ooh, a Magmortar. Is that like machine guns he's got his arms? That's a reversal. And our rare one is, ooh, we got a Hench, a Hench Grass Ginger Milo for art. So at least we get something in these cards, but I, 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 I can't even lie, I don't know who Milo is. But he looks Hench. Look at all that gardening work has got him all buffed up. Beefcake. We'll put the beefcake to the back wall. And move on to the actual Vaporeon tin. Again, similar to the other tin. Everything there is the same. It's just got Vaporeon on the front. Yeah, that's that's the only difference. Now, how can I get into this? Is this going to be another difficult one to get into? Yeah, I have to bite into it. And let's see what we get in this. I can, eh, open it. There we go. And oh, I'm doing this stupid thing again. It's like. Anyway, there's the Vaporeon card, which I actually think looks pretty nice. Let's try and see if we can get out of that damaging air. And, oh, it comes with a code, doesn't it? There's Vaporeon's code. And let's go to the Vaporeon card and see what this one looks like. Nice little hollow, little Vaporeon splash around the water. Yeah, that's, again, it's another nice little promo card you get in this one. So you've got the nice little fairy on, the Vaporeon one's pretty cool as well. Centering's not too bad on it, but yeah, I think I, I don't usually go for Vaporeon. I usually prefer Jolteon or Umbreon, but I think that's a pretty nice card as well. Oh no, I just dropped it. Get up there, get on the back wall. And now let's move into the packs. What packs do we get in this? Battle Styles, Vivid Voltage, Darkness Ablaze, and Rebel Clash. Let's go Rebel Clash first. Got the weird little watery lizard thing on the front. Let's see what we get in this pack. Something just as good, I hope, as Buff Jim, Buff Gardener, Buff Gardener Milo. Let's see what we get. There's the code. One, two, three, four. Let's go. So we get a what is it? A Psychic Energy, Full Hill, Training Court, Double Blade, Dull Blade, Wingal, Wingo, Natu. What's the next one? Barboach. Squirrel guy again. We get a lot of the squirrel guy, aren't we? Applin. Uh, Sandy Ghast. Oh, little, another little clay one. Clay Play Doh, Sandy Ghast, Reverse Hollow. And behind that, we get a, a boss's order. A uh, nice little rare one there. Nice little hollow. Hollow boss's order. And then let's go to Battle Stars. What can we get in Battle Stars? Something good. Let's have a look at Battle Stars. There you go, there's the code. One, two, three, four. And let's go, so we've got a Lightning Energy. Um, Karina's Focus. Uh, Pergly. Uh, Big Bird. Bronzor. Morecrow. Horsey, that's a cool little horsey card. Um, Chirabi, look at, <laughs> what is that look at on doing? After we have to leave that on the side. Oh, and there we go. They get our reverse hollow. There's a tool jammer. And behind tool jammer, we get a. Oh, we got a little V card. A necromaz. Ne necrozma V. So we get our little V card. So yeah, that's cool there. Put you there. So we've got the same so far. So we've got the last one. Three. Well, two and a promo on the back wall. Can we beat it? Can Vaporeon beat Flareon? Right now, they're drawing. Let's see who wins. There we go, and they've got a Steel Energy to start with on this pack. And got a Zebra Strike, a Coating Energy, another little Steel thing. A Hero's Medal, a Beldum, Fanfi, Fampy, a Duskull, a Duskull, an Electric, a Pinecone, when they ran out of ideas, a Crying Thing as a Reverse Hollow this time. Behind that we've got a, oh we get a Charizard! It's not a hollow and the centering's not great, but it's still a Charizard. How come we've got a Charizard that's not a hollow? That's weird. They usually go crazy for Charizards, don't they, in Pokemon? Um, but yeah, that's fine. That's fine. And next one, the last one, is a Darkness of Blaze pack. Let's see what we do in the Darkness of Blaze. And the code is this. One, two, three, four. Now, what do we get in the last pack? 
Got a water energy to start with. Starvia. Combuskin. Uh, Pokemon breed is nurturing. The Taurus. Pansage. Wishy Washy. Rookadee. Aaron. Uh, a Clang. There's a reverse holo. And behind that, we've got a Wigglytuff. So we ended up with the same sort of thing, but we did get a Charizard in there, so I guess it's kind of a win. Uh, but yeah, so far, Vaporeon, Jol Vapor there. Vaporeon and Flareon, equal, both drawing. Um, but we've still got some good cards in it. We've got the big buff Milo. But yeah, if you did like the video and enjoyed it, give it a little like, subscribe, and we're going to have more videos coming out of Pokemon. Uh, but yeah, bye for now.